Hi guys, hi YouTube, it's Chi Chi again from Supple Chic. In this video, I'm gonna just talk about some of my summer favorites, items that are currently on trend, as well as some things that I feel that are essential for summer. Okay, so let's get into it. One of the essential pieces, and as well as, I won't call this trendy, I will call it an essential slash favorite, and I can't really call it a favorite since it's new, but I know it will be a favorite, are cardigans for summer. You want like a lightweight summer cardigan to be cardigan. One, if you work in like in like a corporate environment, you already know that the temperatures are usually arctic in the buildings. If you're going to the movies, if you're going to be out late at night, the temperatures typically drop. But anyways, you definitely need a summer cardigan, a really oversized I don't shape, cocoon shaped cardigan. Now I'm going to bring it up close so you can see it's a speckled knit and this one is from American Apparel. You could pair this with like a tube top and some high-waisted shorts and because this comes to about my knees long and I'm a size 14, 16, I dare say that even someone up to a size 20 could get this cardigan. The only issue you might have is with the armhole. So, um, again, an oversized cardigan is definitely something you need for summer. Okay, that you will need for summer is a summer dress. Now, this summer, in my wardrobe, the summer dress has been reincarnated in a shirt dress um, silhouette. Now, this just this looks like a man's shirt from the '80s or something, but it has this is this this is just a stripe and floral print. Um, shirt dress from actually ASOS Curve. Now, I, the great thing about a shirt dress is that it can be dressed up or dressed down. You could even wear this to work. If you do work in a more formal environment, you want to look for a shirt dress that's like more solid, um, like a solid color or something like black and white or navy and white. Something that's not as, you know, bold because this has stripes, this has florals, it has solids. There's a lot going on with this dress. But definitely, if you do not have a shirt dress in your wardrobe, you want to get a shirt dress. And this one, again, is from ASOS Curve. They have it also in the um, non-plus size section if you're interested in it. Um, but if I can find it, I will link it in the description bar. So definitely, you need a summer dress, something that's light and flowy. I know us plus size ladies love our body cons, but man, when it gets hot like that, I really do not want anything sticking tight or close to my body. So definitely try out um, a shirt dress if you haven't. Another um, summer trend slash, I'm still undecided if I'm going to put this in a, a, as a favorite, are crop tops. So... I have this one here, which is the H&M, Beyonce H&M Summer Collection crop top, which is like a little bralette, bandeau, bustier, whatever you call it. Um, and then I have this one, which is like, I wish they had three quarter sleeve ones at ASOS, because I really don't want long sleeve. I don't. I want three quarter sleeve. But anyways... Um, which is this one from ASOS. It's just a little crop top. And these have some stretch to them. This is a size 14. Right. Yeah. It's a size 14. So just, again, these are great to pair with high-waisted bottoms. So high-waisted linen pants, high-waisted shorts, cutoffs, whatever your heart desires. Um, you can pair them with midi skirts if you have... A flattish stomach or even a high-waisted peplum skirt or a full skirt anyways um but these are definitely great or you could actually rock them with dungarees now I am still on the fence with the dungaree trend 
I don't know. Like, tell me guys, you guys, how you guys feel about dungarees because they're definitely having a moment right now. I digress, but crop tops are definitely a summer trend. So another essential for me this summer, I have been loving like printed black and white tees. Like ever since Celine came out with that shirt that everybody and a mama knocked off. <laughs> um, I've definitely been loving the whole printed tee ones. So this one, which is not on a hanger surprisingly. Uh, and what I do is that I roll up the sleeve. So this one right here is a Wrangler. Can you see that? I got this from Walmart. This is a Wrangler tee. It was like six bucks. Um, and it's black and white, which is what I like. And you can literally pair these with any and everything. You could pair them with midi skirts, maxi skirts, jeans, color colored bottoms you know whatever you can think of you could pair these with i really like pairing these with more tailored pieces to kind of like dress it down a little bit um but yeah definitely screen tees black and white that whole kind of um palette definitely to me that's a trend that's an essential and it's definitely a favorite and another essential for summer for me would definitely be some high-waisted shorts. Like, come on, that's what's summer without some cutoffs, right? I made mine. These are some Lee Mom jeans from the thrift store. You don't have to buy them. If you do want to buy them, ASOS has like three or four variety of shorts. ASOS curves. And if you're someone who is not cool with showing your legs like that, you could you could do a Bermuda. It doesn't have to be. You could do like a boyfriend short. And another piece that you should definitely try for this summer be a bomber jacket. And I will put this under the trend section. So I have this bomber jacket. It's floral print. Um, and this one is from Forever 21, the non-plus section. Again, there are many occasions during the summer where you do need some kind of out outerwear. And a bomber jacket, especially if you get a fine and unlined one, um, is definitely a great way to go. This was only $27.80, so basically $30 bucks from Forever 21. It features this floral print right there. You can pair it with, with a lot of things. I would do this with like a, um, a black tank dress. For like and some strappy heels for a night out. Um, ASOS Curve also has one for um, those of us who have you know who are bigger. Just definitely try a bomber jacket. A huge color, or should I say, not a color, that's been making a big big splash right now in spring and summer, and even the winter that just passed is white. Must have for this summer is your a white jacket now if you're following me on instagram my blog even on here you see me wear my white jacket you definitely need this is not all pure white this is like an off-white so you don't have to get white but like an ivory any color that's like white-esque definitely a white jacket now and that I, will fit into my essentials that would fit into trend and that would also fit into a favorite while we're on the subject of white, if you watched my last haul, you would have heard me talk about these pumps. Another huge trend for summer would be, again, a white pump. So if you don't own one, you should definitely go ahead and see if you can get, get your hands on a white pump. These are from Shoe Dazzle, so you don't have to spend a lot of money. Put the white pump under the trend section. The next item will be a pair of sunglasses. Duh, it's summer. In the trends, favorites, and um, essentials section, because since I got these sunglasses, I haven't put them down. Aviators, they're a classic shape for sunglasses. But right now, the shape or the style to have is the mirrored pair. You can find these everywhere. You can find them at, I know Ray-Ban does them. 
even more expensive designers do them. I picked these up for $4.99 at Ross. So you don't have to spend a lot of And keeping in line with accessories are these chain link necklaces. Okay, I don't want this to look too much like my previous haul. But definitely chain link necklaces are definitely a current trend and and I would call it a favorite because they're just really easy like if you're like me okay so and these are really inexpensive everyone does them if you really don't know where to get them you can go on eBay and Google curb necklaces and I think that's what they call them curb link necklaces and you you will get like a ton that come out so if you so if you're not sure where to get them, eBay is a great place to look for them. Another uh, huge trend, I will put this in the trend in the essential section, would be basic sandals. And the reason why I won't put these in my favorite is because these shoes hurt the <gasps> out of my toes, okay? But they are the basic sandal, and I don't, they are the silver, and they are silver, um, basic sandals these were only twenty dollars for my local rainbow everyone is doing them i saw them at jc penny i saw them at zara which is where i was going to get them originally um and if they hurt like this i don't want to spend eighty dollars and be mad when i'm wearing the shoes so every single person is wearing it's the simple strappy basic sandal the sandal just has one basic band in front and one strap around the ankle and that's it okay go get yourself a basic sandal and the luck we have with these is that for most of them they are the the heel height is not a lot i don't know what this is this is probably like a three and a half maybe four at most in heel so and i chose a metallic color because metallics are the most versatile i can wear this with any outfit in any color with the shoes, again, I don't want this to be too much like my last haul. You definitely want a pair of strappy, like, cage-like booties, shooties, whatever. These are really in right now. Um, if you're not, if you don't want to do a heel, you could also do a gladiator. That whole st really strappy shoe trend is really, really in right now. You could do a pair of gladiator flats. You could go fierce, like, you could go real fierce like Britney from Pockets and Bow and do like the knee high, you know, heeled version. Or you could be go in between like these pair. Or, you know, you could go with like a simple gladiator flat. But something with straps, um, cage-like, that's really, really in. I will put that under the trends and favorites for me um, for this summer. Another um, item that I will put under my summer list would definitely be a small satchel like this. I am guilty of overpacking. I overpack. I like my big bags. But during the summer you do a lot of stuff like you know going out to music festivals going to carnivals going to theme parks and you weigh down by a heavy big bag so i would put this under a essential for me i don't know if this would be so much i don't think this is a trend um and i wouldn't put this as a favorite because i do hate the fact that these bags are little because i can't put all this stuff i want in them and so I always end up just switching back into my big bag. But on those days where I know I'm going to be doing a lot of walking around and I need my arms free, a small bag like this. A a another summer trend slash favorites would be anything with a tropical print. Now, tropical print swimsuits, Forever 21 Plus did the... um. The high-waisted two-piece that everybody went crazy over. Um, I think it was Juicy Couture that was doing, you know, the um, tropical um, palm print suits. Anything with like a tropical print right now is definitely on trend for summer. And for me, it's a favorite because it has all these beautiful, vivid colors on it. So I can pair this with black, I can pair this with anything that has green in it, I can pair this with anything that has orange, even white, you know, and it just adds like an 
that extra oomph to an outfit without me having to do anything. So, so let me know what your essentials are, what trends you are currently trying, and what your favorites are. You can comment down below. You can tweet me your favorites, the trends you're trying, as well as your essentials. And you can even tag me on Instagram. Definitely sound off below about what video you would like for me to make for you next. Uh, so don't forget to rate, comment, and subscribe. And of course, share. Stay blessed.